everybody, welcome back to Park Time Adventures. My name is Jesse. So today we are here for the grand opening of Buena Vista Street. Obviously behind me is Disneyland. It is not Buena Vista Street, but we're just hanging out here waiting. Uh, if we put our name in on the virtual queue that they're doing, uh, it's going to be a two hour wait right now, it's looking like. At least when I signed up, it said there was 450 groups ahead of me. So we're just going to hang out here and uh, wait to get in. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe and already subscribed and like this video and then stay tuned as we go inside Buena Vista Street to show you guys around. We're also going to be eating. Uh, we're going to go to Award Wieners and Smoke Jumpers Grill. So check out those. There'll be reviews on what the food they have to offer there as well. Uh, so go ahead and stay tuned and we're going to go into Buena Vista Street. Alright, so we just got a text that we are able to go into Buena Vista Street. That was actually a lot sooner than I expected. We haven't even been checked in for like an hour yet but the line to get in uh, it's pretty crazy long let's see if we can check that out really quick so here's the line starts there goes all the way over there all the way back there there's a couple of uh, wraparounds there a couple of switchbacks so the lines long we'll see how long we actually have to wait uh, to get inside Buena Vista Street now that we've been gotten our text and been called so let's go check that out so we just about made it line moved a lot faster than it looked so we are almost here we are about ready to finally go back to Buena Vista Street I'm so excited to finally be able to go back in there's only one group left in front of us and then we will get to go in We're getting to go in. Thank you. We made it in. We are back in Buena Vista Street, back in DCA. Remember not too long ago, we were looking through that fence with our camera, trying to see down Buena Vista Street, but now we have made it in. So let's walk around a little bit and see what is going on here. I hear a lot of people cheering. There's definitely a good buzz and energy going on. Everyone seems to be excited to be back. It feels different though, knowing that we're here, but we're not able to go on any rides. So we won't be able to go over to Soaring or Goofy Sky School or Radio Springs Racers. So that kind of makes it feel a little different, but still, it is nice to be back in. And we'll check out all the Christmas decorations. I already know there's no tree up, but there's a lot of trees up in downtown Disney that I wasn't expecting, so we'll go check those out uh, after we're done in here. I know they just restored the Storyteller statue, so we're gonna go check that out. The fountain is on. table set up around the fountain where you can eat. Storyteller statue looks great. Looks all polished and ready for the parks to be open again. So great that they did that. And then we're going to walk down Hollywood Boulevard here first and see what the crowds and stuff looks like over here. It was a long line for the shopping, so we're not going to do that right at this moment. We're going to walk around a little bit first. See when we want to... We have outdoor dining over at Carthay. Oh. I see the red car trolley. I'm 
kind of glad we came more in the evening so that we could see all the lights. And everything kind of lit up. And off the page down here is not open. Obviously, the Disney Junior Dance Party is not open. But Award Wieners right here is open. That's what we're going to be doing for dinner. I have been looking forward all week to getting me a corn dog. And a corn dog I shall have. I'm loving all the lights and everything. We're going to go all the way down here to where the ropes are at. Check out the red car trolley. The Hyperion's all lit up. And it looks good. <laughs> there is the red car trolley, all decorated up for Christmas. The Art of Animation Academy. Schmoozies. You can see Monsters Inc. down in the background. The Hyperion Theater. That just also got a touch up of paint. They repainted that whole facade with the blue sky and all that. That looks really good too. Everything looks great so far. Alright, so the kids are saying they want to try to find a snack. So I believe there's an ice cream cart somewhere around here. We're going to see what we can find while we continue just to kind of tour Buena Vista Street. Carfe Circle. Restaurant, you have to get a reservation there and you have to get here early to get a reservation. Same day reservations only have to be here in person to make one. So if that's something you want to do, you got to get here early. But we're not, that's not on our agenda today. Let's go down here to the left. So, oh, we're looking for a frozen treat, but right here they have, I believe, like turkey legs and hot dogs. Also not on our menu for today. But what I do want to see is try to see what we can see inside of Marvel Land. Or Avengers Campus is what they're calling it. Alright, so we got the kids their snack. We got a churro and a frozen lemonade and a Mickey ice cream bar. So now we're just going to go walk off in this direction to see what we can see. The waterfall is turned on. Grizzly Peak over here. So we get a quick shot of that there. There's some tables right there, open too, right by the waterfall. That maybe we should have gotten to eat our snacks at. But it's okay, maybe we'll eat our dinner over here. And then I'm gonna see how far down we can go. I believe we can go just, the rope's gonna stop us right before the entrance to Cars Land here. So they let us go a lot further than I thought they were going to. We can go all the way down here and take a look at what we can see. And then we can go almost all the way to the entrance of Grizzly River Run in the other direction. And then just past Award Wieners down Hollywood Boulevard, which is what I expected there. Oh yeah, here's the entrance to Cars Land. That we can't get to yet. Oh look, there's... Mater's Junkyard Jamboree, all the vehicles just sitting there. And then there's Pixar Pier and the Incredicoaster. 
hopefully soon all this will be open again where we can uh, enjoy the full park. But it looks like not until next year. Let's see if we can take a quick peek into what's going on at Avengers Campus. Well, I gotta say, it is nice being able to walk down here without a ton of people. There's someone else trying to jump to get a view into Avengers Campus there. Usually this whole uh, walkway through here is usually very crowded. It's one of the main walkways through California Adventure. So it is kind of nice. But I would gladly trade that luxury for, you know, the rides being open. So it looks like this right here might be the main gate entrance here into Avengers Campus. And then just over the wall, we can see the tip of the Spider-Man attraction building. So I'm glad to see that they've got that going still. Hopefully soon that'll be open up too. We can go in there and take a look at Avengers Campus. All right, so we're just going to continue along on kind of our little walking tour of the Buena Vista Street expansion to downtown Disney. Uh, it's getting pretty dark now. It's late, but we'll do the best we can. Like I said earlier uh, in the video, they're letting us further than I thought they were going to, and over here as well. So we'll show you how far we can walk down here and kind of just again enjoy the sights and sounds of being in DCA. We just finished our dinner of smoke jumpers and award winners. So make sure you guys go check out that video. We have, that'll be up on a separate video. So make sure you guys check that one out too. The refreshment corner right here is closed, but the car is still on. And the gift shop right here is not open either. All the lights are on. And there's no one going into soaring. Yeah, that's weird being here when everything is closed. It almost feels like the park is closed and we shouldn't be here, but... And then you can go all the way down to this airplane. And that's where we're gonna end. And hopefully it won't be too much longer here. And we'll be able to go all the way back down. Alright, that'll do it here from Part Time Adventures. Hope you guys enjoyed a little walk around tour of DCA. And you get to kind of see what it looks like on the outside. We'll end here with a shot of Carthay Circle. And then again, make sure you guys like and subscribe if you're not already. And thank you guys for checking us out. Alright, so there was no tree in DCA, but this is the one I was referencing earlier. There's this one over here in downtown Disney, which is actually pretty cool. Almost as good as the one that they would have a DCA. Uh, it's got all these little trees around it. There's like a little line of people to take a picture in front of it. But, awesome tree.